Um, I think it's very interesting because I've been a member of the BHS for too many years. I don't want to actually tell you how many years I've been a member for, but I think it's really nice to see it moving forward and it's a new generation of BHS members that are coming in hopefully. I think it'll have a lot of appeal to younger people. It, it's quite childlike, it's quite friendly, it's quite warm. It, it's definitely the way forward and it appeals to a lot more youngsters as well who are taking their qualifications and things like that. Um, I think it's fantastic. I think it really stands out. Um, I think it will catch people, people's attention. I think it's, it's really good for the BHS. Quite modern, isn't it? Yeah, I rather like it. It's great, you know, all our organisations need to uh, stay with the times and revamp themselves and I think it's a very nice one. It's quite a quantum leap from the, the traditional um, uh, you know, oldish sort of look of that. So that's good. I think, I think the BHS, along with its new logo, have given us a chance to, to see that they really mean to get even ahead of the times. This is quite a warm, soft colour, so and it stands out. I think it's going to look very, very good on pages. Because, to be fair, it was a bit fuddy-duddy before, wasn't it? So, uh, no, definitely on the right track. I like it. It has to, the BHS has to keep being uh, modern and moving along, otherwise it gets left behind, because everyone else is doing that. And I'm, uh, I'm coming around to it, I'm getting used to it. They're not going to leave off all their smaller details that they do, but they're also going to take charge of big issues in the horse world and, and voice an opinion. And I think that's really, really good.